got an awkward bounce there. Breaks for Mackay and then Tiato! Oh! That's unbelievable! An exquisite strike by Danny Tiato! Even the Melbourne fans are applauding. What a goal! It's a good period of sustained pressure from Brisbane. They muscled up in midfield. Tiato winning possession on more than one occasion. And it's not only broad with Tiato, it's exquisite touch with the left foot. That is right through the guts of the football and into the back of the net. And it's an absolute scorcher. In Melbourne were looking very buoyant indeed, but there are a couple of moments where Brisbane muscled up and Enrique exposed the right fullback area of Melbourne. Nick Ward had pushed forward. Tiato won a couple of tackles. And here we go again. It's Enrique. Kemp comes across. And he goes down, the Brazilian, and Srebrenica Domovsky points to the spot. And Melbourne are in all sorts of trouble here. They just lost a goal, and now they've conceded a penalty too. Well, you dare look away. Brisbane could be almost out of sight here in the space of two minutes. Van Dijk, as he did against the Gold Coast, tucks away the penalty. And Melbourne, as they were against the Central Coast, trail 2-0. Seattle. It's well anticipated by Nick Ward, and he can launch a Melbourne counter-attack. He was a bit behind, probably up. Oh, another spectacular goal! If anything, that's even better than Teatos. Carlos Hernandez, Melbourne, back in the game at 2-1. Oh, well, you cop a load of that from the Costa Rican international. It's wonderful. It was a needless turnover from Brisbane. Danny Teatro backing himself for the switch of play. It was cut out by Nick Ward. And it's just instinct. It's pure instinct matched with pure technique. It's pure excitement. Well, we've had pure entertainment here at Etihad Stadium in the opening half an hour or so. Just brilliant stuff. He's fairly leathered that one, Carlos Hernandez. And I can tell you that, that is also the 1,000th Hyundai A-League goal. And a fitting one it was too. Is Enrique attacking Kemp cuts inside lovely stuff by the Brazilian oh it's wonderful it's absolutely wonderful Billy Kenya he's known as the slippery fish and Melbourne couldn't get near him it's another cracking strike and Brisbane leads 3-1 but it's a the Brazilian school in the vacant right fullback area and into the vacant Right-hand corner of the net, that's Brisbane 3-1, and it's stunning stuff at the Etihad. Similar goal to Tom Pondelyak's effort in the grand final. Victory playing on for now. Star striker down on the turf. Kemp. Hernandez. Offs it up towards Danny also. Oh, another screamer. <laughs> what goals we've had tonight. And that's another beauty. We've been spoiled at the Etihad. And the fans have got a sniff that an escape act is on the cards. A good passage of play. Matt Kemp pushing forward from right fullback. Wriggling clear and hitting the ball to Hernandez. And the header is well challenged by Luke De Vere, but the hook, the hook volley from Danny Alsop. It's mouth-watering. It's the fifth of five good goals. And it's an exclamation point on what's been a riveting hour of football. With more to come, you can only suspect. Well, Danny Alsop's first of the campaign, a credit to Melbourne, who uh, didn't kick the ball out of play, so Archie Thompson could get treatment, they wanted the goal, and they got it. And I'll tell you what, I'm not convinced the scoring's over. He's determined by how well they capitalise on those errors, and in spectacular fashion this evening. Here 
got the victory again, and that's a foul by Dodds. Ray Fabiano is uh, not happy with David Dodd. Listen to the noise around Etihad Stadium as Melbourne try once more to get back on level terms. Carlos Hernandez to deliver this free kick. next season or next summer I should say with Costa Rica and with strikes like he's put in the back of the net tonight he deserves to be on the biggest stage <laughs> what a game what an unbelievable night of football 